I'm David Scott. Thanks for watching tonight. A Marble Falls man repeatedly sexually abused wants others to hear and learn from his story. 26-year-old Frank Marquez was sexually assaulted by his uncle, but says he didn't know how to speak out about it. 49-year-old Michael Ribeiro was already a registered sex offender when he started abusing Marquez. KXAN's Jacqueline Inglaze shows how the victim is finally finding closure years after the crime. Growing his own company and holding a beautiful fiance, 26 year old Frank Marquez Jr. seems to have an ideal life. He's focused on his future after facing down a dark part of his past in a Burnett courtroom last month. He was doing things to me with his hands. Uh, he asked me to, to uh, touch him down there. Marquez was sexually assaulted by his uncle, Michael Ribera, three times over three years, starting when he was just nine years old. He says it started with fondling, then escalated to rape. I was like, no, you know, he's like, come on, it's okay, it's okay. And um, I was like, no, I know. At that time, he had his pants down. Confused and uneducated about sexual assault, Marquez kept quiet for almost a decade, though he did tell a counselor. You can't imagine the toll it pays on you mentally. While playing high school football, he could not maintain close personal relationships. Frank says he started to resent his own parents. My mom, and I'll remember this, these quotes until the day I die, she's always like, Frankie, there is one time when you were so loving. Marquez thought his counselor had told them about the assaults, and they didn't do anything about it. But they didn't know until 2008 when Frank confronted his dad, who immediately called police. Rivera was already a registered sex offender at the time. He was arrested after his nephew came forward. Last month, he took a plea deal and stayed out of jail. It still makes me very angry to still see this man walking on the streets. To move past that anger, Marquez wants to do his part to prevent future sexual abuse. I can care less of what happened in the past. You know, the only thing I can do is use that experience to help kids now. Marquez remembers his own original confusion about whether or not what his uncle put him through was wrong or not. He hopes his story gets parents talking with their kids about coming forward if they're touched inappropriately by family members or close friends. This thing can live in them for the rest of their life until they maybe decide to come forward or act out on it or, or you know, have a mental breakdown. Coming forward helped Marquez move on, but he still believes he lost part of his childhood. He's now looking forward to married life and opening up to new friends. It was a huge relief because one thing it was over with, I don't have to deal with it again. Michael Rivera is now running a taco stand that's near two schools in Marble Falls. Marquez says he doesn't regret coming forward, but it did come with a cost. He told me his close-knit family has been torn apart, animosity and emotions still running high. Reporting live in the studio, Jacqueline Inglace, KXAN, Austin News.